my god. God damn it, you take this effing helmet! Oh my god! No! Ah, you go straight to hell! I wonder if in like 500 years, some archaeologist will find it and wonder what it meant. Sometimes I think in 50 years, no one will know what it meant. Places can't control how they're remembered. They just hang out and then fall apart. Ye okay, babe? Yeah. I'll be fine. <laughs> I'm just gonna look for a minute. Take your time. Do I still say hi to my rat babies even though they're self-sufficient now? And they're uh, like electing their own rat president? I don't see why not. I can't believe they just leave the band stuff in there. What if someone steals it? What if the building falls down? I should start taking Greg's base home. Just, you know, in case. <laughs> oh, these guys. Coffee. Oh, they're missing. I'll, I'll be your third. Cigarettes. Oh no, she's cool. <laughs> All right. So wait, yeah, how long have we been here? Has it been like, like four months, three months? Like in real life or in game? In in game, because it feels like we started in the summer, I think. Oh. Uh, in game, it started. It. I feel like it started early fall. Did it? Okay. It, start, then, it starts well because they're already coming up on Harfest. Yeah. Oh right. There's okay. like Harfest like flyers. Uh, so real on, life like, like the day one, yeah. Real life, late August, mid September. Yeah. Okay. You now it's like November. You said it gets snowy at some point, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm excited for them. So I see it get all pretty. I'm one of those people where I really like the snow, but I cannot stand the cold. Uh, same. Hey, you free? Maybe. Want to go on a quick adventure? Oh, is no, there going to be a Jesus platformer? <laughs> <laughs> Don't you have a job? Pastor's gone. I'm going to skip out. Yeah. Let's skip work. I'm only skipping work, hun. <laughs> oh, hush. I'm an accessory to the crime. Also not a crime, sweetie. In the eyes of the Lord, it is. It's not a crime to get a job. <laughs> I don't think I've ever been up here. I don't think I've ever seen her standing. Yeah, this is uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> we used to come here all the time. Did we? No, we isn't. My friends and I, when we were your age. Oh, okay. I'm not used to you using any other Wii's. Dang. Believe it or not, I've had several Wii's. Mom, not the right time for the sex talk. <laughs> oh. huh. We all love Nintendo's beloved Nintendo Wii console. <laughs> but you don't need multiple. You can play Wii Sports just fine with one. She, she's got... She, she's all you need is four Wii remote controllers, and then you've got an afternoon at least full of fun and with all your friends. <laughs> and got, you can also get some exercise in, too, by standing up and doing the motions. <laughs> Are you good? <laughs> Mom, you only need one Wii. <laughs> you can do all that stuff, plus play all the Nintendo's classics on the Nintendo Virtual Console, which I'm pretty sure is shut down by now, but, you know, maybe you could hack it. I don't think they've made new Wiis since 2017. <laughs> That's when this came out. <laughs> oh, true. Yeah. She's got Twilight Princess in one hand and Wii Sports in the other. <laughs> Mom, you, you can play them both... Like, in, in succession, on one Wii, you don't need multiples. You're depriving another household of a Wii of its own that they can play sports games with their family. <laughs> this is nice. <laughs> Used to be a lot more trees up around here. They got cut down when they put in the towers. I don't remember that. You know, all kinds of things happened before you were born. What? <laughs> Some minor parts of history took place, yes. <laughs> okay, everyone's like actually depressed. This is a very reflective episode. Yeah. Or day, I guess, of this. So what is this place? Jenny's Field. Ever heard of it? No, okay, hold on. Hold on. If Jenny's her friend that died, I'm gonna have a bad time. No? I don't think. Back in the 30s. Okay, good. <laughs> when I was young. <laughs> there was this woman and her daughter walking here. 
just like me and you. <laughs> and the woman's daughter was in front of her. Just like this. And then she's just gone. Disappeared. What happened? Turns out there was a sinkhole that opened up when a pillar collapsed in the mines in the hill. Jeez. Yep. No one could see it because of the grass. Her name was Jenny. This is Jenny's field. They never found her. So yes, just let me take my child whoop. here too. <laughs> she was just in, in front of me. In solidarity. Like you are right now. Yeah. And then she's gone. Whoop. What's up? Was she? May, look at the trees, honey. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> gone. So, wait. Why are we here? What? You not up for a little risk taking? Your mom wants you dead. Yeah, a little. <laughs> Hon, you didn't go to college, but you did have a life insurance policy on your head. <laughs> she leaves. Oh, ah! What's wrong? I thought it was a sinkhole thing. Hmm, how about that? What is this? Okay. <laughs> what the fuck? She's actually going to try to kill us. What is this? Wait, hold on. Can you go back and like... Ooh. You did find a sinkhole thing. Yeah. Weird. I should have seen that coming, honestly. I'm just so terrified of what she's planning to do. Okay. What is that? For some reason, before Unified pulled out, they brought this old lime furnace from up down the mountain. Why? Who knows? Unified did a lot of things. Looks like it's been here forever. It's just sunk into the ground a lot. Like Jenny. <laughs> but slower. Uh. We used to climb up there. Want to try? Huh. Oh, sweetie. I had you and also a lot of birthdays and donuts since then. <laughs> and not much climbing. Try it. Yeah. Bye, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, your mom's trying to kill me. <laughs> <laughs> Guys. Okay, this, so this whole thing falls into the earth when I get... Nope. So, uh... Good thing this chimney is sealed up here. Yes. Yes, good thing. Yes. <laughs> what can you see up there? It's been a while. Um, uh, Possum Springs and most of the valley. What does it look like? A quilt. Well, it's a cozy valley. I remember I couldn't tell if being up there made everything feel bigger or smaller. It's a weird th feeling. Yeah, I know that one. I used to have a dream when I was your age, where I was in the big parking lot out by the tracks, and I'd start running, but there was always more parking lot. And Germ, Germ was there too, <laughs> always following me. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of it? I don't know, feels weird to tell you what your dreams mean. Why? You're my mom. Hmm. Fair. Why did we come up here today? Well, I was hoping he'd fall into the sinkhole, obviously. But that didn't work out. That so, is uh... mask off. She's not kidding. <laughs> like, she wants us dead. <laughs> that didn't work out. Drat. Guess I'll have to keep you. I couldn't see what your expression was when you said that. <laughs> Do you need to? No. Well, see you at home. <laughs> hey! <laughs> what was that? Your mom is unhinged. <laughs> Whoops, mom forgot to take her medicine today. <laughs> oh, wait, we completed the page. <gasps> There's a skeleton at the bottom. Oh, that's there sure is. Jenny. <laughs> They're both sad. Why are they both sad? They're cats. They're, that's their little, like, mouth. Yeah. Their little cat they mouth. They do look sad, actually. They do. they do, right? I know this probably isn't true, but it really feels like she was just leaving up to fate. And if you die, it's like, oh. Jenny's field claims another one. Well, I didn't take her there. I was obviously at work. See, I'm still clocking. She went there yeah. of her own volition. Yeah, nip in the air at night. I like fall when it gets cold. Me too. Real pretty out swell. I used to cry at fall times when I was a kid. Oh, fall trees when I was a kid. Why? Because they were so pretty. Hmm. I did like that when my daughter was born. You have a daughter? Yeah. Where is she? Uh, Sorry. It's fine. Oh, dang. Also, I just, I love how casually they're just like, man, it's cold out here. It'd suck if you didn't have a home. Who are you? What the fuck? 
Is that Greg from the future? That looks like a crossbow. <laughs> <laughs> I never made it, man. <laughs> hey, Jen. Hey, May Borowski? Yeah. What are you doing back here? Does Greg know you're back? Oh, wait. I think that's uh, his sister. It's his cousin, I think. Oh, okay. Nah, just here for a day. Had to pick up some stuff from Greg's mom. Hauling back to school tonight. Ah. Uh, Did you go to school? What are you doing here? Dropped out, kind of. Or same as you, just back for a day. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Can you tell the truth? Ooh. Okay, okay. If I know that she might tell Greg, I would have to tell the truth. Otherwise, Greg would know I was a liar. So dropped out, kind of. Yeah. Oh, sorry to hear that. Eh, whatever. What are you going for? I want to do fashion design. Is that a job you can get? Theoretically. You still go crossbow hunting? Greg still does. Kinda. Yeah, I still hunt rabbits and stuff. Nothing big. <laughs> she is a fox. Zootopia. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't get much of a chance at school. I was shooting at the tree over there. Then I noticed there was a dude slipping behind it, so I stopped. Oh yeah, that's Bruce. He's nice. Well, I'm just glad I didn't accidentally put a bolt in his face. Now I'm gonna do it on purpose. Oh yeah, that'd be bad. Well, it was nice seeing you. You still see Greg sometimes? Oh yeah, all the time. Well, tell that cousin of mine he needs to come see me out in Bright Harbor. Oh, uh, yeah, will do. Aw, oh, and he's moving to Bright Harbor. Oh, that's right, I forgot. He's not leaving here. Oh, I don't know. I think he should. Guy's gotta spread his wings. Maybe his wings are just fine here. Nah. Greg's too much of this town. Ha. <laughs> no argument there. See ya. Take it easy. Mm. Jen! What? Greg's cousin, okay? Is this? <laughs> <laughs> Listen, she's kinda tired when she drew that. <laughs> she nearly got killed twice. Can you imagine meeting one of your friends uh, and you just stop, like, can you imagine, okay, I come to the, the, the door here, and you're just like, oh, what's up? And you just start doodling me in a notebook. <laughs> Draw uh, me like one of your French girls. May, what are you doing? Nothing. Can you imagine meeting one of your friends' cousins? The cous Dr. Hanks said I should do this, okay? <laughs> can you imagine meeting one of your friends' cousin, and they're just a slightly larger and, like, slightly off-colored version of your friend? That's what it's like <laughs> meeting someone's sibling sometimes. Oh, actually, yeah. I mean, oh, actually, yeah, that's just me and my brother. Yeah, my brother's just the bigger version of me. Sorry, brother. <gasps> Who's that? Dude. Okay, hold on. The dreams are getting real. Whoa. All right. Hey. Hello. I'm May. Hello, May. I'm Salem. Are you a busker? Are you busking? What's busking? I don't know. I think it's when you play outside and people give you money. Are you going to give me money? No. Then I'm not busking. Cool. <laughs> I don't... I feel like something big's gonna happen. I feel like this is a big one for some reason. It's been a pretty long day. Lori! Drawing something? Yeah, drawing a bad guy for a movie. Have you, like, filmed anything ever? I made a little movie with my phone. And I pirated some movie programs. It's real bad. Uh, what's it about? Or I play bass. What's it about? Um, lady finds a window in her wall that wasn't there before. And it's like looking at her backyard. But it's always sunset. And there's a guy standing there she can't quite see. Jeez, that's actually kind of creepy. Really? I am creeped. Oh, thanks. I thought it sucked. Where'd the idea come from, or so... Where'd the idea come from? I like a lot of horror movies that are really gory. But gory isn't always scary. So I was thinking of what's scary. And I don't know. You're at home, but there's like something new. Or maybe you just never noticed it before. And there's someone strange near, very nearby. And I don't know. Hmm. What? Nothing. Creepy. Alright, I'm off. See ya. Later. Rip. I like Lori. Me too. Check let on the rat babies. Yeah, let me check on my children. Oh, it's, is it closed? Oh, you no. always do that. Yeah, but I thought I remembered it being like partially open. Oh, there's a secret door in here too. 
Yeah, I wonder if. <gasps> what? Secret room. Who lives here? It's like just a room. One fridge, one dresser, one lamp, one bed, one window, one door? I guess that makes two ways out. This would be creepy if it wasn't so spooky. <laughs> Whoever lives here is a certainly a churchgoer. Five saints. Grandma had a setup like this. Last time I saw her. Oh, that explains the, the photos in, in May's room. Oh, yeah, and it's like the sun guy from the, uh... Yeah, the statue by the church. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Icons are good for keeping the good in and the bad out. This is the super important info I retained from years of Sunday school. In the end, Grandmama died while the saints watched. It was time. And they weren't saints anyway. They were pictures. Ooh. What is this episode? Dude. That's such a good line. Yeah. They weren't saints anyway. They were pictures. Pour one out for, gra <laughs> <laughs> for yeah. Grandmama. This is a really good one. Yeah, holy crap. I feel like this day ends in something like, what? <gasps> There's more? I could hide in here until whoever lives here gets back and possibly give them a heart attack or get shot in the face with a gun. <laughs> what am I doing in here? <laughs> what am I doing with my life? I'm sitting in a stranger's closet in a nearly vacant, vacant building. I could just stay in here. Just forever, be here forever. Where does this person pee? <laughs> it's dark in here. All right. I like the final observation. It's dark in here. Okay, so is this door open now? Nope. I wonder how much that rent is. Uh, four thousand dollars a month. Plus utilities. Yeah. Four thousand dollar deposit. No pets. No kids. <laughs> no adults. No partying. No smoking. I saw a listing recently, uh, and somebody posted, "No pets allowed. Don't even ask." All caps. Jesus. And like, I wasn't even that interested in looking at the property, but I literally like out loud. Uh, I don't remember the, the name of the person who posted it, but I was like, literally like, fuck off. <laughs> no pets, don't even ask. Like, it's just like- I would have DM'd them. Do you allow this pet? And then just like, sent like a <laughs> or He's friendly. See, I want what that- What about Billy Bob? And it's just a picture of like a ferret. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's good, I promise. What about this one? It's just a child. <laughs> See, I want more of that, like, chaotic energy, but I'm so socially anxious that even the idea of, like, doing that is like, but then I'd have to talk to them. <laughs> yeah. B. Hey, B. Hey, May. I think I'm going to burn this place down. <laughs> oh, cool. But also, maybe it might have some consequences? Uh, we could take the insurance money and, like not do this. What if you get caught? I saw a show where they caught someone doing that. Hmm. You are going to burn this place down for me. <laughs> oh, cool. But also, maybe I'd go to jail? No, you have no motive. No one would suspect. So work's not go going well. Ah. Okay, I'll actually do it. Please don't actually do it. Okay, fine. <laughs> Did you want to go check out the graveyard? Yes, but not yet. Because I still need to do things. Okay, well, let me know. Yeah, you need to go see if Greg's doing stuff. And not Greg, germ. Uh, germ. Right, yeah, we, we still have to explore the entire town. Um, yeah, there's more town to explore now than ever. Right, yeah. Um, I think last time we decided that we we're going to do Bee's Quest and Angus. Is that right? Yeah. Okay. Because I like Greg, but I think it sounds more fun to do bees. And then we've like barely seen Angus at all, so that one sounds fun. Yeah. Uh, so you know what? Maybe we'll do Angus on this one. Uh, and so I'll just talk to him last, because he's probably there. Does this like a good order to you, or do you think there's a better like machete order to do this? Uh, either one. I think uh, Angus and bees are both very good. Yeah. Um, bees is a bit spookier. 
And Ooh. Angus's is a bit sadder. Oh. I'm feeling reflective. Like everyone's like really depressed and reflective this episode. <laughs> yeah. So if that's what you guys want, I'm cool with it. Or it, we can it, do the more fun it, one. It feels a little more thematically congruent to do uh, Angus today. Right? What the hell is a malt? Good oh, no, no! <laughs> malt is a powder that's like in the middle of like a milk duds. And you put it in shakes to make them thicker. And old people like it because it makes them poop. Oh, is that what is in the middle of an, a milk dud? It's caramel. Yeah, I thought it was caramel. Not milk, what am I thinking of? Are you thinking uh, of Whoppers? No, like malt ball. Whoppers, yes. Really? Yeah. I worked at an ice cream place and all the old people would be like, can I get a malt with extra, 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 extra malt powder? It's just a fucking cookie. <laughs> <laughs> What's in the news? It's just a three-dimensional cookie. Have you noticed there's no three-dimensional cookies? All cookies are two-dimensional. I'm sorry, what? That's hold so on. True. No, cookies are Wait, always two-dimensional. Yeah. Wait, always flat. <laughs> They're always flat. They're not three-dimensional. Like, sure, there's texture there, but you you there <laughs> cookies are only ever in like <laughs> made bigger outward. They never go up. What? Have you ever seen a cookie go up? <laughs> yes. yes. All the time. All the time. Okay. Like, I mean, sure. Like, wait, wait. You half can't. An you inch. can't like wave your hand. You can't say all the time at mine when you're just like your half an your inch. Is, no, trust what me, I'm, bro. Okay. No, 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 no. Cookies they go up like a little bit, and then any additional cookie territory can only be gained two dimensionally. You can never make. <laughs> you can never make like. Have you ever seen a cookie in this shape of like a box? Or what? <laughs> what I'm saying is cookies can only ever be flat. <laughs> there is no you can't have a three-dimensional cookie. What are you talking Cakes about? can be three-dimensional, cookies cannot. <laughs> okay, this okay. This isn't weird. <laughs> At what point Okay. At what point would you call a cookie three-dimensional? When you can make it like just when you can make it like taller. Like, you know how they're flat? What if you made them not flat? That's a three-dimensional <laughs> cookie. <laughs> okay, okay. How, how in all of our, like, treat design over the years have we not come up with, cracked that nut? Okay. Okay, let's let's ignore the fact that brookies exist. Wait, what's a brookie? A brookie's a brownie cookie. Oh, I mean, that's, like, kind of brownie. I don't know. That doesn't, <laughs> I don't know if that counts. Cookies in the name. All right, I'm going to Google this shit real quick. Okay, is Oreo a cookie? Kind of. Uh, well, it's a brookie. What do you mean, kind of? What do you mean an Oreo's kind of a cookie? Uh... <laughs> Let's Google what's a, what's a brookie, and it thought I said what's a brekkie, and it's pictures of dudes with glasses. What the hell is going on? Okay, yeah, what's a brekkie? I don't know. Why are they all just pictures of, like... Is it the same dude? No. Brekkie's a former municipality in Norway. Boy, we sure did. <laughs> Subscribe for more great content, everybody. <laughs> we're, we're tabling this for now, but like, <laughs> objectively. <laughs> Hypothetically. <laughs> objectively, cookies are 3D. To an extent. What I'm saying is. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm, I'm, not even, I'm not even doing that like. I'm not doing the well actually. Yes, you are. I'm not. I'm yes, not, you are. I'm not doing the well actually. Oh shit. <laughs> I I legit just mean like, you can stack cookies. <laughs> yes, plural. Cookies. <laughs> Wait, that was what you said. You said when you can stack them, that makes them 3D. No, when you make it bigger. When you make a single cookie bigger. Why didn't you make the cookie bigger? Would you not want more cookie? You, okay, you know what's you know what's two D? A Pringle. Pringles are two D. Yeah. And a cookie has more depth than a Pringle. Have you ever seen a three dimensional Pringle? <laughs> no. <laughs> exactly. I'm playing the game. I'm done with this. I don't even know why I got on this tangent because you fought me tooth and nail on this observation, and now I now it's lost all now it's lost all the fun. Now you fought me so hard on my three-dimensional cookie observation. You're like, oh, you're a fucking, fucking idiot for thinking that maybe we should make cookies bigger. 
you can only, <laughs> it's fine that they can only be two dimensional. You can't make a imagine a imagine a cube cookie. Why, why do you want a cube cookie? That's a cake. Do uh, do you not? <laughs> <laughs> no, baby. I'm, I can't. I can't. I can't. A cube. <laughs> Yam shortage is Thanksgiving. <laughs> Do I know you? Uh, no. Oh. He's got a little, like, video game bomb in his shirt. Oh, he does. Aren't you Greg's cousin? You really look like his cousin. Not his cool cousin Jen, like the other cousin. Oh, my God. Uh, no. Who are you, then? Why are you here? Uh, I'm trying to find your city council. Town council. We are a town. Right. Why are you looking for them? Hmm? Supposed to be demoing an infrastructure and municipal uh, services management program. What? Helps you manage things like snow plows and broken hydrants and stuff. Oh yeah, we have those sometimes. Uh, just figured it'd be helpful. I don't know, lots of places are just kind of scared of new things. I just want to keep things like, uh, like, hold on. Just want to keep things like they're forever falling apart. It's frustrating. You are really into this, huh? I mean, it's my job, so... I had a job. I bagged groceries. Could you program something to make that job not suck? Well, soon it's all gonna be robots anyway, so... Jeez, yeah. Huh. I got it. You're Donna's cousin. Yeah. She used to be she used to babysit me. Oh wow. Are you the kid that killed a bird with her mace? It was an accident. I was like nine. <laughs> I thought it was perfume or something. I thought the bird would like it. Well, you were nine. It died like instantly, just Ack! Oof. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, well, I'm gonna go. Good luck. Uh, try not to kill anything. No promises. <laughs> All right. Those non-people cats that keep walking by keep fucking me up. And the non-people <laughs> birds that May killed when she was nine. Yeah. Anyway, time to go talk to my bird friend, uh, germ. <laughs> I hope he's here today. Germ! Hey. 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 What? What hangout? I got plans later. Okay, well, I don't think you're gonna get kidnapped or anything. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay, of course. Hop on my bike. Really? Where is it? Dead up behind the boot, donkey. I guess you could, like, run behind. Okay, fine. You sure your bike's gonna be safe? Yeah, I don't think anyone's been in that shit for years. Sorry you fell off. Oh my god. It's cool. I feel so alive. Scrapes are cool like that. I skin my elbow or I hit my... <laughs> um... I like the hit your head pretty hard one. Yeah. I hit my head pretty hard. Did you hurt your brain? Nah. I got a thick skull. That's cool. I like how he also does like the hands up jump. I like to think everyone does that. Yeah. Just so nobody else jumps. What are we going doing here? Do you trust me? Oh, no. So many people are trying to kill May today. <laughs> I trust you with my whole heart. <laughs> really? Yeah, I guess. Okay. Bye. <laughs> oh my god, germ! <laughs> oh jeez, dude. Hey. What the hell, man? Jump, it's fine. Oh, for real? How do I... Oh, just like that, okay. Yeah, you press Hello? down and jump like other platformers. Oh! <laughs> Good May face. Very Good May face. Dude, you scared me to death. That would also like fucking kill you if you were an actual person. Yeah, like, what but is guess... that? Like, 30 feet at least? Cats uh, at jump least, all the time. yeah. Oh, that's true. Yeah, she does fall off of buildings like every day. Yeah. Wow, you jump up big stuff all the time. Oh, yeah. Oh, true. Yeah. Yeah, but like... That's in town. Nice flat ground. Not like I can just go jumping off cliffs and whatever. 
Oh yeah, I forgot you grew up in town. So what are we doing here? I come here a lot. I wanted to show you something. You hang out at a sewer pipe or are you showing me the sewer? Uh, are you showing me the sewer? I thought you'd be interested. I saw like 10 rats down here once. <laughs> well, I have a whole rat family <laughs> here, so. <laughs> okay, that's pretty cool. I love watching Germ walk. It's so funny. Whoa, Hieroglyphs. He does science. <laughs> he does science. This is his laboratory. <laughs> okay, so. I started coming down here a few months ago to, like, just hang. Okay. And I noticed. Oh. Oh, hey, Rainey. <laughs> scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Holy fuck. Ah! <laughs> Rabies is my sewer friend. <laughs> rabies. Its name is Rabies? His name is Rabies. His name is Rabies? I found him when they were pulled up that body out of here. <laughs> After that big flood a few months ago. Oh. Neat. <laughs> he was sad and wet and hungry, so I brought him chips and ice cream. Sounds right. And I wanted the other possums to not pick on him. <laughs> So I named him after something they're all afraid of. This is the best story ever. <laughs> He's so rad. Hey, rabies. Speak. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. He's gonna roll this whole ravine one day. <laughs> you be nice to me, Ra to me, okay, rabies? I love him. You got any pets? I got some rats downtown. Sweet. So there's like weird stuff on the walls in here. Ancient cave paintings. <laughs> Not new, at least. What do you think it means? If you sleep here, you might drown or rabies is trash king. If you sleep here, you might drown. True, true. That's sad. Yeah, but it's sad enough that like it gets too weird to be sad. I guess. Just like, sucks people are sleeping in here. Not like we don't got vacant buildings. It's dumb. There's like, all kinds of secret places like this around town. I'm like the only person to really map the- Hey rabies, what you got there? Oh my god. Is that a fiasco bar? You want me to wrap, unwrap that for you, guy? Holy effing crap. He is the best. You should take him home. No way. He'd pee all over everything. And dig a hole in the wall and live there. Oh, yeah. Rabies is wild. Let him be wild. <laughs> ah, look, he's eating it. <laughs> Rabies is wild. Let him be wild. See ya. <laughs> Let me go where you go. Let me go where you go. I wanna go where Greg goes! No, Germ goes! I want to go where Germ goes. How did he get over this thing? I can't jump that. No way he could have. There's no hole. How did he do it? I mean, I guess he could really be a ghost. I think he's a ghost. Ugh. What's out there? <laughs> Can I really not jump that? Nope. Well, that's the triple jump. So I said I could like, I just like watching his head float there. <laughs> Take you up to the park. You did indeed. You ready to go? I'm excited. Uh, are you? Yeah, we never get to hang out. Yeah, I guess, huh? I've been hanging out with Greg so much. It'll be nice to actually get to know you a little bit, a little better. Hey, pretty great. <laughs> Ghost hunting with Angus. So, you think the guy you saw was a ghost? Not a guy. A ghost. Right. Why does no one believe me that it was a ghost? Well, I mean, ghosts don't actually exist. I'm pretty sure they do. Well, I need evidence. What counts? A ghost walking up and saying hello. And me saying, hey, I verified you're a dead person. Could be a zombie or a Frankenstein. Okay, maybe if they're made of ghosty stuff. Ghosty stuff can be our podcast about ghosts. This episode of Ghosty Stuff brought to you by Donut Wolf. Welcome to Ghosty Stuff. I'm May, and I saw ghosts, and this is Angus, who doesn't believe me. 
I'm Angus. This is May. She's a crazy person. <laughs> that podcast would actually kind of slap. That would. That would be I, good. I, yeah, I'd listen to that. It Should part. that be the episode title, Ghosty Stuff? Sure. I like it. Nice evening. Yeah, it's all right. My mom used to take me up here to play Frisbee. I got hit in the teeth with a Frisbee once. Full speed. Oh, jeez. Casey and me were throwing things at each other's heads. Oh. We stopped after the Frisbee. Posted. Do not feed or touch the wildlife. Well, that seems extreme. I don't know. You can go to the woods to, like, socialize with the woods. I guess. There's some folks living in cabins up here. You can, uh, feed and touch them if you want. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. It's a weird old place up here. There's all kind of weird stuff back up in the park. Old stuff just hanging out in the woods. We'll hit, uh, we'll hit my old scout camp on the way up, I think. Busy woods. Okay, better get going before it gets dark. We wouldn't want to spend a night in the woods. Oh, no. This is his max speed, huh? <laughs> is that you holding as far over as you can? No. No, I'm just oh, matching wow. him. Oh, wow, you were keeping perfect pace with him. I think May's only got set speed. A speeds. chimney! Uh, uh, uh. You all right? Yeah, I got asthma is all. Sorry you got to wait for me. Oh, and you were making fun of his max speed. <laughs> Sorry, Angus. <laughs> um, do you have an inhaler? Yeah, but I save that for emergencies. Being slow isn't an emergency. What is this thing? This is like a lime kiln, I think. Limes? Kim. Lime? <laughs> Limes? Limestone. You like do something with it in there and uh, it becomes this other thing. Oh. Limestone's weird because it's mostly made of skeletons of sea creatures from a millions of years ago. So like this was all underwater or something at one point. Whoa. No way. Uh, no way. I mean, rocks don't lie. Like, right where we're standing. There were like ancient, horrible sea monsters. Creepy and awesome. That's history. Okay, I'm ready to go. <laughs> I was just curious. May's like, oh. Another lime kiln. Uh, uh, uh. Need to take a break? I'm okay, I'm okay. No prob. Uh, uh. So if this place was underwater, um, where'd the water go? Uh, I don't know. To the ocean, I guess. And like, the earth is always shift shifting. So mountains get all pushed up where it used to be just flat ground. Weird, because things are so boring nowadays. To think that to think like all that crazy stuff was going on here. There was always more weird stuff that happened. To find out about later. Okay, I'm ready to go. Cool, cool. A lot of lime kilns. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah. Sorry. Uh. Seriously, it's fine. Hang for a minute. Okay. I should know all of this stuff about like ancient sea creature rock or whatever. Lime. Stone. I was gonna take a class on dinosaurs back at school. What happened? It was all full up. That class fills up fast. I bet. Uh. Dinosaurs are like the most interesting animals. You know they had feathers? Or some of them. I know, right? Big freaky chickens. Things were so scary and cool back then. We'd die in like five minutes. Tee -hee. 
<laughs> we about die in like five minutes. Tee <laughs> Oh yeah, ancient creatures would eat us, no problem. Be glad for the millions of years between us. Weird. Time, dude. Time makes most dangerous things less dangerous. Most things, at least. Okay, you ready to roll? Yeah, we're almost to the top. Wow, I got dark fast. Well, that was a hike. That was a lot easier when I was 11. We passed, what, three gates on the way up here? I lost count. Weird. Used to be open back then. Hmm. Ready to go? Not far now. Just up ahead. Oh, there's some gravestones. Graves, huh? Yeah, these were... I forget. They were involved in the Possum Massacre? That, like, labor strike thing. Where it was, like, the Miners versus National Guard. Happened back in town, like, a hundred years ago. Why are they up here? I think they were some of the bad... I think these were some of the bad guys. And some of the miners. <laughs> didn't want them buried in town. Oh, and some of the miners didn't want them buried in town. Oh, huh. There's, like, a few old graveyards up here from, like, colonial times. I guess there's one up here somewhere, too. Well... That's spooky. Eh, just bones. Ancient shark bones. Yeah, see? Nothing left to be scary. I don't like that you turned up the volume. <laughs> oh, I, I just like the ambient noises. Okay, I, I feel like there's gonna be a jump scare. A jump scare? <laughs> Can you imagine a jump scare in this game? Yeah. Wow, we're really high up. Or oh, really high, and really far out. I can't see town from here. It's uh, it's south of us, behind whatever ridge that is. So what? So what? Are we just supposed to wait here and see if anything happens? <laughs> you tell me. You're the expert. I guess we'll just wait here and see if anything happens. <laughs> nice night. Yeah. Back at school, I couldn't see as many stars. That always made me sad. Oh yeah, they're really nice up here. I wish I knew the constellations like you did. What? You know all the names and the stories and stuff. I wish. I can never remember them other than... I think that one up there is like a bell or something? Mr. Chaskov knows all about them. Yeah, our favorite bear. Fuck you, Angus. <laughs> I take that back, I don't mean that. No, 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 no. Remember that time we were all at that longest night bonfire? And we spotted the constellations together, and you told us all about them. Oh, that was actually a mini game that they put out for the Kickstarter when the game was in development. No way. Yeah, that's oh. included on the uh, like that's included in the game. I love that. Yeah, we could play that sometime. That's not a thing that happened. Oh wow, maybe it was like a dream or something. <laughs> God, I barely remember now. I wonder what fake constellations and stories you dreamed up. Okay, humor me. I'll find the constellations, you tell me about them. Uh, okay then. Oh, do I gotta draw my own constellations? I don't know. Alright, find me some constellations. <coughs> Wait, are these gonna be real ones or fake ones? Just ones I remember. Or dreamed that one time. Ugh. Whichever. Remember Mr. Chazikov? Yeah, science teacher. He lives in Underhill and has a telescope on his roof. And I totally saw some stars through it. That's cool. Telescopes are cool. Wish I had a telescope. Okay, let's see. Okay. Ghostly hand. Ooh. Okay. What's oh. a funny shape? I think it's gonna like have a predetermined path. Oh, okay. Okay, cool. It's the fire breathing guy. It's a Pope. <laughs> he breathes fire. Oh, this one is real. Uh, or at least the dude is. Rubello. 
There's a statue of him outside church. Oh, we never went there. Marco Ribello. <laughs> uh, did your family not go to church? Uh, weddings and funerals and longest night, basically. I don't think those first two count. Those are like events. My mom works up at the church now. I haven't gone really since I was like 14 or, 14 or 15. Uh, does she mind? She pretends not to. Yeah, I see where this is going, and it will make me sad. Thank oh. you very much. It's an oval. It's a whale! <laughs> Look, it's a three-dimensional cookie. <laughs> you got really weirded out by that observation. I was making <laughs> no, a just... you refuse to play in that space with me. <laughs> It's just it's just funny now. Like I'm with you, but it's funny now. <laughs> oh, you're with me now. Well after fighting me with all of your might. You trenched in and fought me tooth and nail on that bit. And now you think it's funny. Well, I I, I lied to you. I gave you, you some ground. I, I'm still not with you, but you had to defeat me first. Then you're defeat? like, oh, I, I guess I think When did I defeat cookies? You shot my idea down so hard and then you're like, oh, I guess a cookie can be three dimensional. <laughs> it's a whale! And it's got like the world on its back. <laughs> Oh wow, that's sad. <laughs> yeah. Um yeah. Kind of a lot of responsibility. Do the whales consent to this? I think it just always was that way. Oof. <laughs> you gotta wonder why people made these up. I mean like these specifically. Who saw a whale and was like, needs to be carrying something? I mean whales are pretty big or they didn't uh, I mean, whales are pretty big. But what's the whale swimming in? Space. I guess it's dumb to get mad at ancient people. It is. <laughs> With an eye. It's Bill Cipher. <laughs> okay, Bell that's a Cypher. bell. Bell Cipher. Whoa. <laughs> and in the middle is the eye. Looking at you. Oh, that's, uh, uh, I don't know this. Oh, I know this one from, uh, one a little from, like, prog rock album covers. <laughs> I think the world ends when you when it rings. That makes sense. It's got to be really loud. There's no sound in space. I mean, basically no sound. Usually. That sounds really scary for some reason. <sighs> well, Yanni. Well, at least it means... We're not going to get rung to death by a bell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love these. Yeah, this is fun. I, I, I love Night in the Woods mythology. I'm still waiting for the shoe to drop, and it gets sad, though. Oh, it's it's gotten sad. The guy died trying to steal a diamond. Ah, the, the way we all die. Yeah. It's a cat. He's got arrows sticking out of him, and he's chasing the diamond. Oh, I know this one. I don't remember his name. Uh, he lived, uh, you remember those stories about the forest god? No. It was like a whole bunch of stories. There was this person, Adina, and... Oh yeah, Adina and the Frozen Lake. Yeah, that's one of them. Anyway, the cat was in there, and, like, Shiny Things was good at getting through the, uh, like Shiny Things was good at getting through the forest, it was really good at stealing. Oh wow, yeah. I used to call him Ass Cat when I was little. <laughs> that's a good Sky that's a good name for a Skyrim Khajiit character <laughs> that steals things is Ass Cat. <laughs> well, when he stole a diamond from a king, he got arrowed to death. But he was a uh, he was slick enough that he jumped out of his body Whoa. and became immortal or something. Whoa! Cool. Huh. Decent. Extremely decent. That one's my favorite. Yeah, I like Ass Cat. We're like way out here, huh? In the park? Yeah, I guess. Spooky. Uh, I don't know. It's pretty safe. And the stars are pretty. So you don't believe in ghosts at all? No, nah, don't believe in ghosts or gods or psychic powers or anything like that. Not at all. I mean, there's no evidence for them. And people have really tried. Did you ever? 
Yeah, when I was a kid. Tell me about it. So, um... I don't know how much I told you. Or how much Greg has told you. But I didn't have the best childhood. Yeah, I think I heard that. Why was it bad? Uh, my dad didn't like me. And my mom didn't either. And like... Uh... You don't have to talk about it if you don't want to. No, it's fine. Um, my dad... He used to hit me a lot. And my mom was probably worse. She, like, wouldn't feed me. Which was why I really like cooking now. <laughs> Which is why I really like cooking now, tee-hee. <laughs> What's with your tee-hee, dude? <laughs> Which is why I really like cooking now, tee <laughs> She'd like shove me into the pantry and slam the door really hard and all the stuff would fall over on the shelves on top of me. Oh my god, Angus. I didn't know at all. That's awful. She'd lock me in there for like a day at a time sometimes. Holy shit. Or overnight. So I'd like try to develop psychic powers so I could like signal the neighbors. Or unlatch the door. Didn't work, as you might guess. Did you ever tell anybody? I never did. I don't know why. After a while, I like... Started feeling guilty too, for some reason? Like this was something bad I was doing? Like... Being abused? Angus, that's not your fault at all. You were a kid. Oh, don't worry, I know that now. But, boy, do I ever. Question. Can I go kick all of their asses? Like, I've got experience, I can F some shit up. <laughs> well, my mom is kind of old now. I, uh, still have to visit her sometimes. I have a brother, he's overseas in the army. And my dad left, like, ten years ago. So who knows where he is, or if he's even still alive. If he is alive, I don't want to know about it. Angus, I just want to give you a hug forever. <laughs> well, I was luckier than a lot of kids. I'm just glad I didn't like... Yeah. A anyway, to your original question. Testing out my psychic abilities in the pantry made me really interested in both the paranormal stuff and science. And I joined the Skeptic Society on the internet. And, uh, that kind of ruined me a lot of other supernatural bullshit. He, he joined slash R, he joined R slash atheism. For in this moment, I am euphoric. <laughs> and it gave me something to solve. Something you could debunk, or no. I don't know, it saved me a little bit, I guess. Because when someone does all that stuff to you, it can make you do some bad things to yourself. But anyway, yeah, no gods are god. No ghosts are god. So like, I feel like if I'd been through that, I'd be more likely to want to believe in God or something. Do you believe in anything at all? Uh, well, so like the constellations, I don't believe there's a whale out there, but uh, I believe that stars exist and that people put the whale there. Like, I don't know. We're good at drawing lines through spaces between stars. Like, we're pattern finders. And we'll find patterns. And we really, like, put our hearts and minds into it. And even if we don't mean to. So, I believe in a universe that doesn't care. And people who do. Pattern finders. I feel like a lot of people don't think they found God. But, like... God found them. Like when they were having bad times like you did. God never did. I was completely alone in the pantry. But a few years later, Greg did. So like, the stars can stay up there and not give a shit about us, but this whale is pretty cool. You're an extremely good and smart person, Angus. 
I try. But I'm no more than anyone else. Yep. Yep. I should come out here more often. <laughs> yeah. Don't look at him. Who? Oh! oh. I see him! <sighs> oh, no! Uh, there's no one standing behind us. In the trees. Oh, I don't like... Holy shit. Holy shit. What do they look like? Tall, wearing some kind of coat. Like a utility coat or something. Oh god. That's like that's the ghost. I'm more worried about being a, it being a living person. Standing in the woods, staring at us. Oh god, oh god. Well, don't panic. Follow my lead. You slipped into like Hank Hill. I know. I, I thought that too. I, was like, <laughs> I hope they didn't notice the spontaneous Hank. Um, the spontaneous Hank. Well, I feel, I feel like when hey, you there. slow it down, like it, the register's just there. Follow my lead. Uh, hey, hey there. Out for a hike? Nice night. He's not answering. That's a little hostile, right? That's definitely a little hostile. Hey! I know what you did. Mate, no. I saw you. Okay, well, we're going to run now. We need to get to the car. But your asthma. I got an inhaler. The good kind, too. No one in heaven or earth can stop me. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. Deep breaths. In. Out. All right. Ah!